Okay. Hello everyone, my name is Lance 90 and welcome back to Let's Play Cataclysm and Dark Days Ahead. If you're new to the channel and you're watching this episode first for some reason, you might be wondering why I started the intro that weird. It's uh, just because the game crashed last episode, so I had to re-download the game to hopefully get a more stable build of the game. And now we have to go back and do everything I just did all over again. I hate it when that happens. Reload our gun this time, so that, I, that I'm prepared. Holster. Okay. Drop. Slider. And press the die set. go. Still... Oh, you know what? We haven't slept yet, actually. It saves it before you sleep, so when you reload the game, you're not asleep. Or you haven't slept yet. It is what it is. Kind of like it if it would, uh... I don't think I made any of that, like, pizzas and stuff I made this morning, either. I don't want to do that again. Well, at least we kind of know what's going on. We figured out what was going on with the... Let's just make four meat pizzas. I don't care anymore. That's a lot of pizza. Alright, let's uh, have a drink. We should be good to go. Let's hope it's not crashy. So hope I can find everything I want to find. Arm system, we need the joint torsion ratchet, we need the battery system. We don't need anything else there. We want these memory cards. Looks like this spawn is all the same stuff. Ugh, which means there's like a lot of uh, stuff with batteries in them I have to unload. I could let it go, but... Batteries. Is there anything in the back room that was even important? I think there's some super glue back there. I guess I'll try to go get it. Super glue. Solder. Useless book. Storage CBM. I don't think that last thing was worth anything. Let's uh, unload this crap. Okay, I think that was everything. Alright. It's all the joint torsion ratchet. Maybe we'll save the game here so I don't have to do all that again if it crashes. 
If it's gonna be unstable, we're gonna be uh, a little bit safe, scummy. It's not on purpose, mind you, this time. Feels like there's a lot more zombies than there was before. Come at me, zombros. Being a little bit risky coming after them like that after I hit them the first time, but I don't care. Oh. Basic repair kit. Okay, so I don't have to make the uh, repair kit now, which is good. Is there somebody else there that was useful? I think I was just reading the repair kit. Portable toolkit. Let's buy duct tape. It serves as a vital tool. Required for fixing items made of wood, bone, or chitin. Requires 50 units of duct tape per use. Use it to craft a toolbox. Interesting. Yeah, there's more zombies here than there was before. Oh, there's a zombie necromancer, that's why. I'm guessing I kinda have to kill him first. Yeah, now we're getting to the stuff that was on the edge of our vision, so we should be finding new stuff again. A fungal drug could probably be useful. Okay, let's get... Oh, there's no back door, so it's a grocery store now. Interesting. Oh, maybe it was on the side. Yeah, it doesn't matter. Cookies. Uh, no, this looks like it's the same one. Like it has the same spawn in it. I don't think there's anything else besides those sausages that was good in the back there. Yeah, this is the same stuff as before, so there probably is a back door, I just didn't see it. Tater chips, tater chips, popcorn, it's gonna be wheat. Mm -hmm. The soups look like they might have been different things than they were before. That ATM. This is transfer all money to this card. So I can drop these other cash cards. <laughs> we're slowly becoming a millionaire. Anything else here that was worth our time? Honey, gummy vitamins, soap. Okay. Doesn't matter which cart we grab, pretty much. Uh, it's a big ol' turret around here somewhere, so I want to keep away from it. Did I go in this building yet? I feel like I've been to this building before. Like, I don't think I went to this building last time I was here. Is this, this a grocery store? Oh yes, the town's gonna be a little bit different too, I think. Because it was, it was out of our vision, so now it's new. Interesting. I don't know how this is going to change us, but it will a little bit. Oh, we should grab that cornmeal actually. Let's uh, stand in front of a window and check out what these books are. Oh, yeah. Some books are worth our time. 
Unfortunately, this means we might not get a library this time, but this one had a few books in it, so I might make up for it slightly. Not really, but one can dream. It also might mean that turret is gone, though. Okay, that's everything. Uh, I'm a little bit heavier than I was before. Oh, the repair kit, I guess. I don't know, it's still not useful to have that in my inventory, I think. Yeah, I think I'm gonna keep it with me. It's good enough to deserve it. Okay, so the game is still... Okay, I have that, but... It's still pausing a little bit. But... You know what, the portal's drill doesn't use batteries, even though it sounds like it does. Steel jerry can, hmm. Thing is, I have a huge freaking keg. Uh, I don't think I need it. Normally that would be something I'd be all over, but right now it's just not too important. But we have lots of duct tape, so I can take this repair kit and reload it. Long strings always take. They're pretty good. New tool belt. I shouldn't need one now. Uh, did I see what was on the other side here? I don't think I did. A circular saw blade is not useful now. As far as I know. People. Take a single torch, though. Jackhammer and pickaxe. Uh. all of my gear here. Batteries. Oh, did I actually use all the batteries? Oh, I used all the batteries from those flashlights. Need the jackhammer. Why am I so heavy? Oh, they're selling torch, yeah. That would do it. I guess I can drop the base repair kit. I'd like to carry it around with me, but it's not something that's gonna be super necessary. Pickaxe, it's probably gonna come in handy late game. I'll take that thread, I was just commenting on my sewing kit being out of thread. book is... I do not need it. Oh, the library does seem to be back. Okay. Did I not go in the hardware store last time? It's a tiny bit odd of me. I don't know exactly how the map generation in this game works. Like, we've looked at a road map here, so... Maps generated, but uh, I don't know. I have no idea. What the fuck? Okay, that really scared me. But it's a smoker zombie. Wow, that was weird. I was like actually scared when I saw that on the screen because it's just so big. I was like, whoa, what was that? <laughs> that was weird. I've never been scared by this game before.
It freaked me out. Like, I actually got, like, chills down my spine when I slam. Smoker zombies are a pain in the butt. You can't, like, really shoot them. So we basically have to run in there. Guns blazing. Ugh, it's not healthy though. Do have the inhaler. I don't have my emergency oxygen kits with me though, so. Coyote might fight the zombie and kill it. It did. <laughs> Thank you, Coyote. Um, fortunately, you're coming at me, so I had to kill you there. It's nothing personal. But that was the decision you came to. Alright, I do want to transfer everything from 2 to 4 here. Because this cart is in better shape. Not that I think it matters terribly much, but... It's a new roadmap, but I don't think I need to read it. Mustard... Um... Boring sandwich. I'll take it, I guess, just in case. And I'll take the long string. The other long string. Fusion peroxide. Could be pretty useful. Old cheese, old bird eggs. Old, old, old. old. Sausage. Blagna. Sports drink. Energy drink. Crispy cranberry. Lots of spaghetti. That's all really good stuff. For crafting delicious noms. It's funny how your definition of good stuff in this game changes as you progress a little bit. At the start of the game, you like really don't want the raw macaroni and stuff. You're like, ugh, I can't eat this right now, this is not helpful. Later in the game, it becomes a little bit more useful from the uh, other stuff because it makes you happier to eat it. I don't know if this is all going to fit in there or not. Nope. Gallon jug of vinegar. Damn, it's like the one thing I want to fit in there. But, well, it's, uh, activate our holster and put our gun in it. Very time. Okay. I'm really gonna check all these. Let's see if I just shift V, I can probably. Yeah, nothing. Nothing in those shells worth our time. Zombies, though. Come on at me. Then I have to shoot the bloated zombie because they explode. Hopefully that doesn't catch the building on fire and make it fall down. Probably will. Probably need to hurry just a little bit now. 
Especially because I shot and broke some glass. Rude. I don't think that'll help. I think that's level one driving skill, but I'll take it anyway. These books, I think, might be different. Maybe. Yeah, these are different books than before. Um, are they worse books or better books? Well, that history and armor making might help tremendously. Yeah, I have to step. I did that wrong. I didn't have to step through that cloud. I thought the door was in that direction. Alright, let's save it again. Generation's the same, there'll be a turret down there. There actually is not a turret down there, so map generation is not the same. I just need something to confirm it. Those book those books are different. I just don't. Oh my god, there's military gear up there. Uh, it might not be military gear, it might be science scientist gear. It's inside of a park though, that's new. Maybe it's not, maybe it's dead. Hey, it's dead kids. Anything terrible? I'm a soldier. What's this? Oh, this is military gear. Uh, well, we don't have that Kevlar harness anymore, so yeah, I should grab the boots. I'm gonna have to kill these kids the old fashioned way here. Door there, of course, there's a door there. It's locked. You, I'm gonna have to go over the fence. I'm gonna have to smash it down, I guess. Ugh. Looks like it's smashed here, though, so let's... for there to be uh oh, there's a military ID car that made that made that pretty much worth it. I'll take the dump pouch and the MBR vest. The MBR vest if I unload the metal plates from it, it'll actually be like worth a crap ton of uh Kevlar plates and then I can just drop let's actually just drop the combat boots now because I know the MBR vest has enough. Assemble it, I think. That gives some, and then if you cut it up, it gives like a billion. Yeah, 24 freaking Kevlar plates from that thing. It's amazing. We are thirsty. Let's eat our cream soda and some cookies to cheer us up. Mm, excuse me. I think the cart might have a little bit of room left. Yeah, it does. Just couldn't take that off. Here, if I just put the... Eh. Try to put this food in there for a 
worse, I guess. The Galjack's not gonna fit them. Now I think it's probably completely full. Yeah. And we're pretty close to capacity here. If I activate my holster, my gun away. So I think what's like going on is like the map buildings are set in stone. But the loot and zombie spawns are random. Makes sense to me. I think we do have an armor book, is one of the books we found. Which might make this reload worth it. Let's save it here, because this is kind of where it crashed before. Oh, I think I started talking about it a moment ago and then I kind of lost track of myself, but... Um, I am noticing it pausing every now and then, just a little bit. But it's not as crazy as it was previously, where it would... It's like very noticeable. Like I don't even think you guys will really notice the hang-ups it's having right now. On occasion. But before it was noticeable for both me and you. Is my gear okay? Yeah, I mean I hit by acid so I was a little bit concerned. Liquor store, grocery stores, but I think we're good for food. Can't a zombie, skeletal doge. Skeletal dogs gonna kill that kitty. I'll save you, kitty. Boom. I hit him hard and sent bones scattering. Sporting goods. Ooh, apartment towers, that's a little bit scary. I'll be cop, he might have something good if I kill him. Wow, I really hit him hard. This way and then go around. Kind of want to avoid the apartment tower if I can. You know, these zombies that came out of it. Zombie killing spree here. Actually got hit in. I think it was because he was a grabber zombie, so he grabbed me. One at a time, zombies. One at a time. I kind of hate knocking them back. I'd kind of prefer for them to just keep coming at me. Boom, boom, boom. Boom. It's a big cash card. I will take it. pretty much out of time for this video so if you enjoyed it please leave a like or a comment and if you want to see more please subscribe hope you all enjoyed and have a good day